Slasher! What's going on? <laughs> me, me fly here. <laughs> see something from sky Littlefoot must see. What is it? <laughs> it big surprise. Follow me. Hello, little foot. Dad, you're back! All I see is the day in front of us. All I see is the day in front of us. Burning bright with a newborn sun. Come fall on me. Here's the climb and first to go. Shorty are back in the Great Valley, Dad. I know it's sooner than our regular visit, but... You do know why your dad's here, don't you? Run, you're here. We were beginning to wonder if you were going to make it. I've already begun to set up the testing place. Testing place? Yeah, for the big long neck test. Huh? The Big Long Neck Test is a series of tasks many young long necks must face before they reach the time of great growing. It's usually given to a young long neck by his mother or father. That's why I'm here. So, what do I have to do to pass the Big Long Neck Test? Ah, that would be telling. The test is designed to see if a long neck has the qualities needed to someday lead a herd. Whoa. You better get to sleep early tonight, Littlefoot. Grandma's right. At the first sign of the bright circle, we'll head out to the testing place. What's the matter, little foot? Nervous about the test? A little. I really want to pass this test. But I wish I had more time to prepare. Braun says it's the kind of test you're either ready for or not. <laughs> that sounds like something Ruby might say. Well, I think you're lucky. I really want to take the test, but Braun won't let me. It will be your turn soon, Shorty. Once you're ready. But I'm ready now! Uh, maybe you could give Shorty the test today, instead of me. <sighs> it's time, little foot. Let's go. I am ready to be a leader. Why don't I take you over to the watering place? You can play with Littlefoot's friends. Yeah, okay. I bet I can prove to Littlefoot's friends I'm ready to be a leader. <laughs> Everybody, look! Here come Grandma Longneck with Shorty! Hi! Hi. Hello, Hi, Shorty! Hi! 
Shorty has come to play with you while Littlefoot's off with his father. Oh, that's great! <laughs> Thank you, children. Come and join us, Shorty. We are playing Swimmer and Splasher now. No thanks. I can play Swimmer and Splasher anytime. But while I'm here in the Great Valley, I want to see the Great Stone Walkover. The Great Stone Walkover? Yeah, Littlefoot told me about it last time I was here. It stretches high above the fast water. I can't wait to walk across it. Uh, I'm not sure we want to. Sounds like fun, an adventure. Yeah, and Littlefoot's told us how you all love to go on adventures. I want to go adventuring, adventuring, adventuring. I want to go adventuring to the stone walk over now. But do you even know the way? A walk like that could take all day. Why would we follow you? Uh, because... Because I've already taken the big long neck test. You have? Of course! And that means I'm ready to lead my herd on an adventure. So now we're his herd? Excuse me, Shorty, but the stone walkover is that way. I knew that. Uh, I was just gonna take a drink first. I am not so sure he would be able to find the walkover by himself. Yeah, well, if he gets lost, then we won't have to deal with him. But I really want to see the Great Stone Walkover, too. Oh, all right. Hey, Shorty, wait for us. We'll go with you. That's right, follow me. Here we are, son. Now can you tell me what the big long neck test is? The test is comprised of three separate tasks. Each task ends when you find a red tree star. A red tree star, okay. Now, the first task is a difficult path that will test your strength, endurance, and courage. You'll need to reach the top of Flat Mountain to complete the task. Uh, okay. It's 
disgusting. You get used to it. I can't go on an adventure with someone that eats like that. Mm. You can't? Ugh, no way! Ugh. But I want to see the Great Stone Walk over, too. It's okay, Chomper. Let's you and I go to the Great Stone Walk over. Everyone else can go with Shorty. Oh, great. Lucky us. <sighs> Come on, let's go catch up with Shorty. <laughs> well done, little foot. Now it's time to move on to the next task. The next task is a test of intelligence. You must find the second red tree star, which is hidden within this forest. How am I going to do that? You have three clues. The stars have fallen, face the tree fuzz, and root out the problem. The stars have fallen, face the tree fuzz, root out the problem. How am I supposed to find a single red tree star here? There it is! The stone walkover! Now, which way to go? Me fly up and see which way best. I think I would like to rest for a while. I would. I would. Well, fine. If you're gonna rest, I'll lead everyone else without you. What? You can't just leave them behind, too. Watch me. Hmm. Okay, we will meet you there. Bet you can't keep up with me, or are you too afraid? Afraid? <laughs> Sarah, Shorty, you taking long way. How could Shorty possibly have passed a leadership test? Maybe a test for bad leaders. The stars have fallen. Face the tree fuzz, root out the problem. Hey, that tree doesn't have any tree stars. The stars have fallen. Wait, if this tree doesn't have any tree stars, how am I supposed to find a red tree star here? Stars have fallen, face the tree fuzz. Tree fuzz, and it's only growing on one side of the tree. Now. Root out the problem. Let's see. The red tree star! Well done, little foot. Now you can move on to the final task. So long. Well, uh, well, we decided to take the adventurer's way up. Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. oh, careful, Shorty. You don't want to get too close. This walkover doesn't look that high. Oh, but it is. It is very, very high. Huh? You're all just scaredy eggs. But I'm not. Whoa!
headed this way. Miko asked them for help! Your final task is to find a safe way across the fire pit. So, what long neck quality is this supposed to test? I can't tell you. That's part of the test. Well, I might be able to use those rocks to get across. But the fire bubbles might burst onto the rocks. So it's not a very safe way across. Uh, there must be some other way. We're here to help you help Shorty. Looks like you could use it. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Can we fall already? Wow! Uh, thanks for your help, everybody. Yes, You're yes, welcome. Yes. Mm. Because of all your help, I'm gonna let you two be part of my group. Uh, gee. Thanks! Huh? I've used logs like that to cross rivers and canyons. But I know if I push the log into the fire pit, it'll catch fire. That's not very safe either. I guess it's against the rules to ask for a hint, huh? Uh, this way, everybody. That? Not way back. So, there's no point in telling him. He's too busy leading us to listen. <sighs> me wish Littlefoot here. Let me see if I can't give our leader a little leadership. You know, Shorty, sometimes the best leaders know when to let someone else lead. Really? Uh, sure. So, maybe you should lead us to show you the way. Right. As the leader, I want you to tell me how to get back. Okay. Follow me. If I can't find a way across this fire pit, I'll fail the test. And I don't want that to happen. Big, big, long neck test. The very big, big, long neck test. It's been tough, but kind of fun. I've had to think and climb and run. Now, one more task, and I'll have done the long. so hard to complete. I'll figure it out. There must be a way. Crossing bubbling fire by myself just doesn't seem safe. So how do I do it? Big, big, long neck test. The very big, big, long neck test. It's something that I've got to do to prove that I'm a leader Jump across the fire pit. <laughs> oh, there's no way I can jump across that big fire pit. <sighs> I'm sorry, Dad. I just can't find a safe way to do this one. 
I guess I'm not ready to be a leader yet. Congratulations, Littlefoot. You've passed the big long neck test. What? But how? I didn't cross the fire pit. How could I pass? This test was different than the others. It was a test of judgment. The task was impossible, and you correctly decided not to try it. What if I had tried to cross the fire pit? I would have stopped you, and you wouldn't have passed. But even if you failed the test, Littlefoot, I'd still <laughs> love you. Let's go. Here they come. Did you complete the test? Yes, he did. Dad, someday I hope I can lead a herd just like you. Well, Littlefoot, it seems that you already have your own herd to lead. Oh, great. Another long neck leader. Hey, Littlefoot, you gotta tell me all about the test. Don't give Shorty any hints, Littlefoot. Huh? Hints? Shorty's not quite ready to take the big long neck test. I'll say he's not ready. Hey, wait! You mean he hasn't taken it yet? Uh, no, but I will soon. Hmm. Not too soon, I hope. <laughs> <laughs>